probably one of the best things I've ever done. Uh, awesome. So I, I couldn't recommend that more highly enough to, to anyone. Just, just to give it a go, reach out, have a chat. Today we've got the awesome Mr. Ben Coombs on. Uh, ben has just finished up, or a couple of weeks back, finished up in the 1% Blueprint programme. He's kind of taken 20, 30 minutes out of his day to have a chat with us about our experience, what he's learned, and some of his, my words, not his, but I would say awesome successes. Um, before we dig into all of that, Ben, do you want to just introduce yourself, who you are, what you do, a bit about you? Yeah, thank you, mate. So uh, I'm Ben Coombs. Uh, I am a quantity surveyor by trade, but... Uh, uh, I run a business uh, based down here in Brighton. So we do a project management uh, and quantity surveyor and building survey. And I do that with my my business partner. So uh, we have a firm of about 20 people. So um, that's the sort of uh, background to me as a, as a business owner. And uh, I've, I'm, I've got a, a wife uh, and, and two young children as well, sort of 11 and nine, which uh, keep, keep me on my toes as well. What was going off with you and what was your motivation for talking to someone like me, a coach, about about helping out? Someone that's sort of reasonably high up or making decisions in a business, you, you become so focused on that, uh, that that is always to the detriment of all the other things. Because you're so focused on your business, you're not necessarily present at home. And that was definitely the case with me where I, I would be checking my work emails quite a lot over the evenings and the weekends and I was there. I was present, but I wasn't. Physically, yeah. I wasn't. I was there just in in, phys, in physical form only. Mentally, I, I I was. I was either too knackered. I didn't really want to engage. I didn't want to do a lot of those things. So you start doing that, and after a while, you think, oh, I don't know. This isn't really. This isn't really living. This is sort of just existing, and, and there has to be a bit, a bit more to it. Let's fast forward now. Say three months from there, where we are today. Let's touch on some of your key successes and some of the you know, the things that you've got out of the process and the program. And then once we do that, let's maybe touch in some of the things that you've learned in order for those things to happen. If that, does that sound make sense? So, what, what would your like you know top three or four successes or you know? From, I think it, it wasn't it wasn't a key aim when I started. I think I said the same thing to you, but uh, I, I, I like probably. Uh, a, lot, a lot of blokes carrying a little bit of excess uh, uh, timber around the middle, but uh, I'm a, I'm quite tall. I'm relatively relatively slim, but actually it became important to lose that weight. And it was once you'd lost some of it, it was incredibly uh, not it's not necessarily noticeable externally. Although I felt I felt great as a result of doing it. So I lost about 10 kilograms. Is having all lost all of that, so it's sort of stone and a half, it's, it's, it's pushing nearly two stone now, which is great, is, is that actually uh, you can wear shirts that you weren't previously and you feel you feel happier in them. You, 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 you're you looking down and you think, well, okay, there's not, not as much belly there, which is great. And uh, and all those little things, you feel better about yourself and, and that portrays out uh, into the wider world and how you you've got more confidence as a result of it so that definitely that is definitely the case so that 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 was a huge one focus has been another huge shift so um being able to sit at your desk for however many hours of a day um but actually be very productive in those uh eight hours what would you say some of the, the key learnings that you've taken that have helped sort of achieve that and get to that the massive bit I got with working with you is is that obviously you 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 build you build up you you add incrementally over a period of time so you're you get used to doing certain bits uh, just to to start you off and they're they're not too taxing uh, they are just get on with it and get them done and actually you start really feeling the benefits and then you start adding to it week on week on week and building it up. And by the time you get to the end of it, you're armed with a toolkit of what you need to take away the day. What would you say to someone who's kind of on the fence with it, but they know they need to make a change, I guess? Giving yourself an honest appraisal. Uh, and I, I think a lot of that will resonate with a lot of people. And, and then thinking, actually, yeah, I do need to, I do need to just reach out and say things aren't quite right. But what can I do about it? Uh, which is a big step is to is to say right, yeah, I can I can change. I think it's really really important to invest, particularly as as, as sort of a business owner or someone like that, where time is sucked away by uh, all all the pressures of running a business or, or managing 
people is to give the best version of yourself. You've got to invest in yourself, and you've you that that might be reading, education, learning, and, and this is all part of it. Mentally challenging yourself and, and arming yourself so that you can actually change your life because it is it is very life uh, life transforming. It's, it's probably one of the best things I've ever done. Uh, awesome. So I, I couldn't recommend that more highly enough to to anyone. Just to, just to give it a go. Reach out, have a chat, um, and have a look at it. And, and I'm sure you'll see plenty of other people that have done these like you and I do it now. And uh, they will probably all be saying the same thing. Um, that it, it is life transforming. Thank you very much, Ben. Well, on that note, um, thank you very much for your time. I hope for anyone watching, you've got a lot out of it. I think, like I said, taking a step back, Ben, it's been a pleasure working with you. You deserve all the success you've got. And I know you're going to keep on flying with all this stuff. So it's been great to work with you. If anyone is interested in having a chat, like, and, you know, working on some stuff like we did with Ben, give me a shout, drop me a note in the comments or drop me a, a message. On that note, have an amazing Tuesday, guys. Um, and we'll speak soon. Ben, thank you. Cheers. Thanks, all.